Hi, this is Ryan Brown from mockquestions.com. In this video, we'll discuss five environmental engineer interview questions from our website. We'll go over each question and some advice on how to answer them, along with an answer example. Afterwards, if you found this video helpful, please like and share. That would mean a lot to us. Okay, let's get started. Question number one, if you are hired, what is the first contribution you will make to this company? Often in job interviews, you will get a question about how you will contribute or add value to a company. This question gives you a chance to explain what makes you stand out from other candidates and how you will be an asset to the company. The best way to answer it is to give examples of what you have accomplished in the past and relate them to what you can achieve in the future. Here is our answer example. My previous work experience included innovation in many areas, including developing strategies for more effective teamwork. At my previous company, I devised strategies for improving teamwork and communication among the members of team projects. This resulted in more efficient projects with higher profits for the company. I can bring not only my ideas from my previous job, but also my general passion for innovation to your organization. Question number two, what advice would you offer someone considering a career in environmental engineering? The interviewer is asking this question to hear more about how you got into environmental engineering and what you like most about it. They want to know more about what aspects of the profession you are most passionate about and if that fits with their company's goals and vision. You can discuss how a professor or relative inspired you to pursue the career or discuss your strong interest in protecting the health, welfare, and security of future generations. A lot of people I've talked to think that engineering of any sort not just environmental engineering, it's just about math, science, and formulas, and it's not. It's a very challenging and rewarding career that is essential in solving modern day problems and environmental issues that we are facing as human beings. There will always be engineering jobs, an increase in public awareness of environmental hazards, and a dramatic rise in population is likely to contribute to the rising demand for those who have the knowledge and skills to lead the pack as environmental managers. Question number three, how do you explain engineering ideas to an audience who's unfamiliar with the topic during a presentation or an important meeting? An environmental engineer will work with many different people. It's essential to let your interviewer know that you are confident in communicating complex engineering topics to people of any skill level and background. Your answer should clarify that you have a strong understanding of engineering concepts and understand the importance of communicating those concepts. Before the interview, consider listing some complex engineering concepts and how to simplify them so that others can understand the big idea in terms they can relate to. I do my best to give examples of engineering concepts that are easy to understand and that might relate to a person or their specific situation. For instance, if I'm sitting down with a group of construction workers, I will compare what I am saying to the process of paving roads. Relating complex engineering concepts to real situations gives my audience a better understanding of the project in terms they can understand. Question number four, what will be your biggest challenge in this position? In an interview, the employer's ultimate goal is to assess if you are a good fit for the position. To do this, the interviewer may have you reflect on what you think are the most challenging aspects of the job. As you prepare for your interview, take some time to think through how the role will challenge you. Review the job description to inform your answer. Start by breaking down the job into its various components and thinking about what you need in terms of skills and knowledge to accomplish each task. Think about any elements of the job that will require training or additional time to learn and be honest in your response. You can also mention that you are motivated by challenges, can effectively meet challenges, and have the flexibility and skills necessary to handle a challenging job. One of my biggest challenges will be adjusting to the new workflow technology and creating a new type of report to present to your clients. I plan to ask a lot of questions when preparing my first technical report. I'll also ask a colleague to review the report before sharing it with the client. Question number five, describe a team experience you found rewarding. Teamwork questions are the most common of all behavioral interview questions. The interviewer is asking this question to learn more about your ability to work on teams and with other related consultants to achieve a common goal. 
Environmental engineers usually work with other engineers and scientists who design other systems and with technicians and mechanics who implement the designs. The ability to work well with others is a critical skill for most positions. This question is also meant to determine your priorities in the workplace. All candidates, whether seeking management or non-management related positions, should be prepared to answer interview questions about working on a team. My most rewarding experience was hiring and training five new interns during our annual summer internship program, all of whom developed into excellent full-time employees and contributing members of the teams that I managed. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, it would be greatly appreciated if you could subscribe to our channel. It really does help motivate us to continue creating videos. Thanks again, and we hope you stick around to watch more interview practice videos from Mock Questions.